Hello all YouTube viewers, uh, this is PC Master JJ here, and uh, today I got an iPod Touch 4th generation white edition for uh, my birthday, and I'm going to show you a, an unboxing and a review uh, for the iPod Touch. So here it goes. Uh, I'll put the camera right there. There's the label thing. Apple always has the greatest um, boxing packages to sell their product. And uh, obviously this iPod looks awesome, so let's see. I also got my iPod engraved. Uh, so let's take this off. And as you can see, uh, there's the engraving. One words fail, music speaks. Take that off. The new, that just looks awesome. There's that, the front and the back, with the engraving right there. When words fail, music speaks. Uh, we also have a uh, set of earphones and a USB cable, US, the newest USB cable. And uh, like I said before, the earphones. Uh, I love Apple's earphones, they're always the best. Um, never find a better, better pair. Uh, other, other ones I've uh, always used, either the speakers went out or the um, headphone jack wore out, something like that. But Apple's are always the best. Um, we also have some fingertips. Uh, there's the, I guess, uh, hazards. Stickers, love those. And some fingertips. I see pretty pictures. And a little bit of stuff about the iPod, it looks like. And uh, I will be right back with a review for the iPod. Alright, uh, welcome back everyone uh, to the review part of my unboxing and review video. A um, couple things I want to talk about before I start. Uh, the first ever iPod Touch that I owned was the iPod Touch first generation. Uh, that was the black one. Uh, it didn't come with any uh, cameras or speakers or anything like that uh, or even the app start uh, to be honest so that was way back you know in 2008 or 2007 when they first came out um, so this was a huge jump for me in the Apple world if you want to say it that way um, the first thing I want to talk about with uh, the iPod is the beautiful display um, I had a case on it and then I just took it off uh, same iPod though uh, as you can see with the engraving right there um, it has a beautiful crystal clear uh, 3.5 inch display. Uh, beautiful for anything you want to look at or anything. Um, it also has good speakers uh, that are located right there. They kind of look like the uh, iPhones also. So They're pretty loud too compared to the... Um, my sister has an iPod Touch 3rd generation and uh, they, her iPod wasn't very loud but mine uh, was a bit louder. So Apple definitely improved on that part of their uh, upgrade. So I'll just play a little bit of a song for you. Alright, uh, yeah, so you can say it's pretty loud. Um, the other thing was the camera. Uh, it has a beautiful camera, 720 megapixel uh, camera. That's HD. Uh, also has front time, and if you switch it around, it's on that side of the room. So, uh, it's pretty cool. Um, you can always switch back and forth, like I said. Uh, and it also does video, too. Uh, if you switch it, well, that was just on uh, video. So, if you switch it back to camera, video, so it, switch, it switches pretty easy. Uh, I've taken in several videos on it, and it, they've uh, all came out. Uh, exactly as I like them to. Um, it also comes with a this battery on the iPod lasts uh, 40 hours, and that's just uh, continuously on when it's fully charged. So that's very impressive for uh, anything that uh, Apple creates. Um, all right, so that was the outside. Uh, next uh, section of the video I like to talk about was uh, or is the inside. Um, this iPod has uh, iOS 5, which is the new operating system 
for the iPod Touch. Um, the features I was want to talk about. Um, this iPod comes with a ton of new features, uh, which just makes it you know uh, better all around. Uh, the first feature I'd like to talk about was the double tap. If you uh, tap the home button twice very quickly, uh, you'll see you get several buttons at the bottom. Um, first one is a speaker control, I guess you'd say. Uh, how volume control, uh, how loud or soft you want it. Um, then next you got a play button, a forward, backward, and uh, music button, all stuff like that. Uh, and then there goes your uh, apps and everything. All my apps are on the bottom here in case I don't want to uh, slide over or anything like that. You can launch any app from there. Um, oh, go back. There we go. Okay. Uh, the next uh, feature. I don't think iPod uh, Touch third generation has this either. If you go from anywhere, uh, you can always go from the top and scroll that down. Like that. Pretty cool feature. Um, these also has reminders. I'll talk about those later. But it gives you the weather and your reminders, and it's pretty cool. Um, I always found that useful over the couple days that I've had this iPod. Um, also, it has a Twitter or Twitter inter integrator. Um, uh, it's mostly used on the camera, but it can also be used anywhere. Uh, if you just take like a simple photo, and then you go to it, um, it should be, yeah. When you go in your pictures, um, you can usually send it right to Twitter, which is pretty cool. You can press tweet, print, uh, you can use it as your wallpaper. Or even email it, so that's pretty cool. Um, another uh, feature that uh, iPod third generation doesn't have. Uh, next is the Game Center. Uh, this comes pre-installed with your iPod. Uh, it's right there. It's like a uh, multicolored little uh, four-square thing. And what it is basically, you can. It's like an app that uh, lets you integrate all your other apps together. Like if you want to play online or something like that. Uh, that's mo mainly what it's used for. So you can use it. I've already used it for uh, uh, what is there? Uh, the, like games, uh, first-person shooter stuff like that. Um, also reminders. Uh, they're pretty cool. Um, like I said, you can see them anywhere from just dragging down. Um, I connected my Facebook, everything to this. Um, and it also reminds you uh, when you press the unlock button, it'll show up right here. Uh, I don't. I obviously don't have any reminders right now, but uh, if I did, that's where they would show up. Uh, let's see. Oh, security on this thing too. Um, the security I found was uh, phenomenal uh, compared to the first generation. Um, it also it obviously has the uh, lock feature with the buttons and uh, the passwords and everything, but I had never gotten into that. So, uh, but it has a new feature uh, in case you lose it. I think it's called. Uh, find my iPod or find me. Um, it, what it is basically, if you lose your iPod or uh, something happens to it and you can't find it or somebody stole it, you can go on uh, iCloud and you can delete everything off of it or you can make it make a noise so you can hear it or something like that. You know, um, that was pretty cool. I thought. So uh, I talked about all the features and the uh, inside and outside. Uh, once again, a beautiful display, and uh, over the past couple of days that I've been using it, it's a pretty good video, or it's a pretty good iPod. So, um, much better than my first iPod was, and uh, my sister is also thinking about getting one too, so uh, I definitely re recommend it, and uh, please, uh, if you have any questions about it or anything, I'd be willing to answer them. Uh, thank you for watching, and uh, please subscribe, and uh, comment, or, you know, like it. Um, thank you very much, and, uh...